Brought to you by wikivd.com Frederick R. Koch Frederick Robinson Koch is an American collector and philanthropist. The eldest of the four sons born to American industrialist Fred Chase Koch, founder of what is now Koch Industries and Mary Clementine Koch. Early years Koch was born in Wichita, Kansas. His paternal grandfather Harry Koch was a Dutch immigrant, who founded the Kwana Tribune chief newspaper and was a founding shareholder of Kwana. Acme, an Episcopalian bishop William Burnett Kinney a politician and Elizabeth Clementine Stedman, a writer. Beginning in eighth grade Koch attended boarding school, namely Pembroke Country Day School in Kansas City, Missouri rather than living in Wichita. With his family, he attended high school at Hackley School in Tarrytown, New York. Frederick studied humanities at Harvard College unlike his father and his three younger brothers Charles G. Koch and twins David H. Koch and William I. Koch, who studied chemical engineering at Massachusetts Institute of Technology and pursued business careers. After college Freddie enlisted in the U.S. Navy, serving in Millington, Tennessee near Memphis and then on the aircraft carrier USS Saratoga. Upon return to civilian life Koch enrolled at the Yale School of Drama, where his focus was playwriting. He received a Master of Fine Arts degree from the school in 1961. Philanthropist Through personal and foundation acquisitions Koch assembled large and important collections of rare books and literary and musical manuscripts fine and decorative arts and photographs with works of the 19th and 20th centuries predominating. He is reported to be a keen scholar, and highly knowledgeable about his acquisitions. Among his private collections is the archival estate of George Platt Lines, and a vast archive of society photographer Jerome Zerby. Cox Frederick R. Koch Foundation is a major donor in New York to the Pierpont Morgan Library and the Frick Collection and in Pittsburgh to the Carnegie Museum of Art. Of particular note to the Frederick R. Koch collections at the Harvard Theatre Collection, Horton Library at Harvard University and at Yale University's Beinecker Rare Book and Manuscript Library. Yale President Richard C. Levin described the Koch collection as one of the greatest collections to come to Yale since the year of its founding. Since the 1980s, Koch has bought, restored and maintained a number of historic properties in the United States and abroad including the Donahue House of Woolworth Mansion in Manhattan, the Habsburg Hunting Lodge Schloss Blumbach near Salzburg, the Romanesque Villa Torre Clementina in Cap Martin, France, and Elm Court, a Tudor Gothic manse in Butler, Pennsylvania. Koch financed the full reconstruction of the Royal Shakespeare Company's Swan Theatre in England. From its 1879 remains although his role as the project's patron was kept secret for years. In 1990, Koch bought Sutton Place near Guildford the former residence of J. Paul Getty and the legendary meeting place of Henry VIII and Anne Boleyn from another reclusive art collector. Stanley Seeger redecorated the house and hung his art collection but is said never to have spent a night under its roof before selling it for £32 million in 1999. Other sources say he operated it as the Sutton Place Foundation open to the public for more than 25 years and that he ultimately sold the property in 2005. Koch served for many years on the boards of directors of the Spolito Festival and the Royal Shakespeare Company. He remains an active, long-serving board member of the Metropolitan Opera and the Film Society of Lincoln Center. In 2010 the New Yorker reported that Koch had moved to Monaco which has no income tax. Despite lavish philanthropy and millions spent on art acquisitions and property restoration, Koch is said to have a frugal streak and reportedly prefers taking the public bus in New York.
and typically flies commercial according to Vanity Fair. Brought to you by Wikivd.com Would you like to know more?